Blue Uniform Guy here, and this is the John Deere 1365 Mower by Fast Farming on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here for this test of this John Deere mower. It is 21.45 megabytes to download. Slots on console are 11 slots each. We'll find it under mowers. There it is, $22,500 to purchase, 90 horsepower required, 3 meter working width at 13 miles per hour. We have some configuration options, Trelleborg, BKT or Lizard, rubber extension options, yes or no, conditioner extension. That little thing there. Yes or no? New decal or old decal? And the old decal isn't just old style, it's literally missing pieces and old. Kind of cool. Toolbox, yes or no? Warning triangle. Beacons, yes or no? Work mode, standard or Groper and main color we have new paint or old paint if you pick the old paint you get a discount of five thousand dollars so that's pretty neat um yeah five thousand dollar discount so all those other options you picked will cost you less right so let's hop into the uh let's say shall we say non-groper version you do get it like this and we'll just unhook it to show you hooking it up there so uh, there is unfold L1 and X unfolds it actually it was unfolded now it's folded for transport unfolding it does this not a whole lot to this, except we do have some options. We have L1 and right stick up and down will change the angle at which it follows. So if you want it to follow more in line with the tractor or right stick and down, L1 and right stick down, it will follow a little bit further out. So with this model, you can, uh, L1, R1, and L, L3 swath dropping or wide spreading. Let's turn it on and lower it. So wide spreading is, as you would expect, just wide R1 and L3. You can have it drop a bit of a swath, which is a bit narrower than, well, otherwise it would do. All right, there's already an issue with this with the worker as you would imagine. <clears throat> so, I'll show you that. We'll hire a worker here, and it doesn't matter what position you have the mower in. Uh, it pretty much does the same thing. When it comes to the end, the turnaround is the problem, actually. So here, even if you have quite a bit of room at the end of your field, he will go through this very painful procedure to turn around as you will find out very soon. We'll actually go halfway up this little field and then back up. And back up crookedly, mind you. And then eventually decide which side he wants to go on, start mowing, and yes. So, um, the problem with that is they tend to uh, miss bits at the end quite badly, like this. Now, having shown you that, let's show you the groper. <laughs> Now it operates just the same as the other one, except now you have the option to 
uh, left swath, whoops, not that one. There we go. Left swath wide spreading or swath dropping. So with the left swath mode on, as you would expect, it drops the swath to the left. Um, unfortunately, the worker also does a very job of turning this around. I won't show you the painfulness of that. However, everything else seems to work quite well. If you use it manually, without a worker, it'll do just fine. Uh, and so, let's go work mode. If you can lift that and use that if you just want to uh, widespread or the swath drop, like so. So it is a nice little mower, just unfortunately the workers seem quite a bit confused how to use it. And uh, there it is, that's the John Deere 1365 mower by Fast Farming on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you all for watching. And remember, it's only a game, so till next time, bye for now.